I am a bit excited. Yesterday evening I got this in the mail. This means they tried to deliver a package. Of course, nobody was home. And I really, really hope that it's the new iPhone 7. Okay, let's go. I forgot something. This definitely doesn't look like the iPhone. because there's something smaller in it and the size could fit but it's a bit heavier okay this is probably the most boring thing I ever received in a package it's a birthday present for someone that I ordered two weeks ago and now it showed up okay Today I have to hurry up a bit, Vanessa's parents are coming later for dinner, I need to go grocery shopping and prepare the dinner, so I might only have 6 to 7 hours here today in the studio, which isn't the biggest problem, I think I'm working anyways way too much in front of the computer. You know, I think I asked you two vlogs ago how much time you spend on the computer, and most people answered something around 4 hours. Let's see how many hours I actually spend a day in front of my computer. I have a program that um, counts the hours you're using the computer and it counts back to the very first day when I bought the computer around uh, I think 2 years and 11 months ago. And I got right now 8971 hours. That's totally crazy. 8,971 hours within 35 months. That's 256 hours a month, 64 hours a week, or a bit more than nine hours a day. And that is on average for all of the days in almost the past three years. So that's really a lot. If you factor in the one day a week where I'm trying not to work, plus the vacations I had, this number is even higher for the days I'm actually in the studio. I don't really use the computer for private things, I would say 90% of it is really work and the rest is probably editing these videos daily and the TV shows we watch usually on the Apple TV and private things I do with my phone I don't even want to know how many hours are on here. At the end, I don't really mind. I just love making music and it involves using a computer. So let's get started with work and add maybe six to seven more hours to the count. Wherever I am, wherever you are, you can do the light on my soul. People actually don't know how time-consuming it is to produce music. I sometimes spend an entire day just listening to the same 8-bar loop and trying to find a solution to the problem. And I mean you just have to listen to what you're doing and listening to things all over again and all over again just takes up a lot of time. Now it's time to get all of the ingredients for the dinner tonight. I got everything. I'm just a little bit late, which wouldn't be a problem 
if Vanessa didn't forget her keys. Now I think her parents are waiting with her in front of the apartment. Dinner is done with at least 45 minutes of delay. Because Vanessa forgot her keys. Okay, because I was playing. Either? dinner was really great. We made some Thai curry as we learned to do it in Thailand. You might remember it from the vlog. I'm sitting at a different spot. Vanessa already started packing a bit for Saturday. I would probably just start five minutes before we leave. So it's now almost midnight. I'm trying to squeeze in one or two more hours of making music. That's the only way to get better and to be more productive. It's the same with trying to become a soccer player or anything else in life, the more time you're doing it, the better you will get. And you also have to keep in mind that there are a million of other people out there that want to achieve the same thing. And if they just spend more time practicing, they will be just one step further than you. So you have to try to keep up. And the only way to do it is to spend as much time as possible. Not so much that you can work the next day, but as I said, I think one more hour is easily possible. You know, there's something that is also quite time consuming and that is editing videos each and every day. It's almost the same as with the music where you have to listen to it to fully understand it. With the videos you have to watch what you've actually recorded, which takes up a lot of time and then choose the best parts. So I'm probably the only person on this planet that is stupid enough to try to do both after having spent quite some time today in the studio and working right now I will still have to edit this video that you're watching right now before going to bed didn't play acoustic guitar in a while fingers always hurt